The group has reportedly been terrorizing and hijacking public members, robbing them of their goods and using fake number plates to confuse them. Police have been hot on their trail for some time and made a breakthrough yesterday at a local bar where the robbers are suspected to hang out. Two suspects are still at large and Oshana Regional Police Commander Commissioner Naftal Sakaria has given a stern warning to criminals that his forces remain on their toes to apprehend them. Look at this registration number on this vehicle. This registration number. Look at the clothes. Look at special equipment to replace the number quickly. The clothes to change immediately. When you are chasing them, he's wearing what what? All of a sudden. He's wearing a cap and a hat in the overall. Now, if you come with me, you would realize that uh, here in the car, there's a panga. Commissioner Sakaria says the robbers have resorted to car rental places and use those vehicles to commit crimes. He says the Oshopala location, which is popularly known as Angambia, harbors a lot of criminals and it is congested as it is not well demarcated. Sakaria says criminals who live by the sword should be prepared to die by the sword and that if a criminal resisting arrest draws out a weapon with the intention of harming police officers, they will be dealt with. The police came and they were stopped and they, they charged with a knife. He charged the police with the knife. Warning shot, go back. He's just coming. Warning shot. Go back. He's just coming. Warning shot. Go back. He's just coming. Eventually, he was shot in the leg. He, he was very lucky, this officer, who fired all these rounds. He's not supposed to do this. He's not supposed to do this. Somebody's charging the police with a, a, a knife, with a weapon. He will not be this lucky. Ndapandashuya, NBC News. Oshakati.